Hi everyone, welcome to the Essence of Life. Thank you for tuning in. This is a Libra reading for all signs, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Also cross watchers as well. Thank you all for watching. So we can jump into your reading. We've got messages here from the Romance Angels to outline this reading today. So we've got codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. We've got let your friends help you. Ask for and accept support from others. Let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. And this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Okay, so let's get some tarot tap into the energies surrounding your situation this week. Do you remember energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. There's no gender in tarot. It's all just energies. So please take the messages as it resonates for you and your situation. Okay, so we've got three cards spread, giving us the Ace of Wands, Temperance, Sagittarius Energy, and Seven of Swords. So that's further clarified. It's Seven of Cups, Six of Pentacles, and the Star, Aquarius Energy. Further clarified with the World in reverse, Four of Swords, and King of Cups in reverse. Okay. Right, so this reading is a... Yeah, it's picking up the energy of a... Someone that is just... Uh, they could not get you off their mind during this time. And the thing is, it looks like this is someone that is around other people. <laughs> this is someone that is around other people. Seven of Cups here. Six of Pentacles. I mean, yeah, this there could be a, another situation. This person has... This person is attached to outside of you. This person has options. Seven of Cups. Yeah, this person has they're they're around other people. But yeah, all they do is think of you. Yeah. <laughs> that song I'm getting. No matter what I do, no matter what I do, all I think about is you. Even when I'm with my boo, <laughs> I'm going crazy over you, yeah. Nelly and Kelly Rowland. My boo, that song, yeah. Even when, this is it, this is, <laughs> this is the song I'm channeling, this is the energy I'm getting. Because even when this person is around other people, when they're with their boo or whoever they're with, they still think about you, no matter no matter who they're around, all they do is think of you. It's crazy. <sighs> we got this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Yeah, this person feels like you're the one. Six of so we've got the star card here. This is destiny. It could be an Aquarius. You or this person has Aquarius in your chart, most probably. It's a possibility. Or we've got Sagittarius energy as well. They could be a Sagittarius. They feel like you're the one. Because I really feel for some of you, you know that this person has someone else. Or they've got, you know, other situations going on outside of you. Which is why you pull back your energy. Because you're not involved in this equation. I can see Six of Pentacles in reverse. Lack of balance here. Temperance in reverse. Lack of balance here. Because there's some kind of third party interference. Yeah, I mean, even on this card, there's three people on this card, you know? And you got this man in the middle given to two. You know? 
And then it's like, why they got one person waiting, they're there giving to the other, while they got someone waiting, and then waiting for their turn. And it's like, they just go back and forth. This person likes to have their cake and eat it. I mean, <laughs> yeah, this came out in reverse. You pulled up, you took yourself out of this equation. <laughs> this came out in reverse because that that's just an imbalance there. This, you know. You took yourself out of this equation and I feel like ever since you did that, this person has not been able to stop thinking about you. I mean, I feel, I feel like this person's got feelings for you, clearly. Anyway, they just want to have their cake and eat it. We've got King of Cups here. I feel like this person, they got a lot of emotions for you. They've, there's a lot of um emotional attachment here to this situation with you. They may have water in their chart. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, but yeah, this is someone that's got feelings for you still. And uh, like I said, they feel like you could be the one. they got some romantic feelings for you. I mean, this is someone that suppresses it, clearly. King of Cups in reverse, you know. They haven't revealed their feelings. And then since you took yourself out of this equation here, I feel like their feelings have just gone stronger. Because they just can't stop thinking about you. And it's affecting their relationships they've got going on outside of you. Clearly. Because Seven of Cups is in reverse. Which goes to show that... This person may be dropping their options. Or, you know... To focus on you here. I feel like they're getting a reality check. <laughs> They're getting a reality, yeah, this person's getting a reality check, it looks like. Because uh, they can't stop thinking about you, clearly. It's like, deep down, they want to be with you. We got let your friends help you. Answer for and accept support from others. This person may be getting help. Some support from their friends in this situation here. But they can't stop thinking about you. We've got codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. This person is codependent on your energy. Wow. So, yeah, let's get some further insight from the Love Oracle deck. Just the messages for this reading. So, we've got self-indulgence. Focus on self. Self-worth. Not enough. Frustrated in relationships. Sunglasses. Watching. Looking. Stalking. The Sword and Rose, Clarity, Truth, Soulmates, and Love Call. Right, so, this is what I'm saying. This person's thinking about reaching out to you. They're thinking about reaching and out. They're, they're thinking about a passionate new beginning here, Ace of Wands. They're thinking about a new beginning with you. This is why they're dropping their options. That's what I'm saying. It's getting to that point. Because they think about you so much, it's affecting what they've got going on outside of you. Like, any relationships, anyone they're seeing, it's it's affecting it. It's it's not really working out because deep down, this person wants to be with you. All they do is think about you. Yeah, they want to reach out. We've got love calls. Someone expresses love, a message of love. Thinking of you, letting you know, yeah... They want this passionate new beginning here. We've got a new beginning. I feel like this person is going to reach out here and open up to you. Because we've got Seven of Swords in reverse as well. Like I said, this is someone that was hiding their feelings. I feel like Seven of Swords in reverse. Yeah, this person's ready to come clean. They want to reach out here. They want to reach out. Yeah, this is what I'm getting. They're ready to open up, turn over a new leaf. They're dropping their options and everything. Because they're, they're, this person stalks you. They can't stop watching you, looking at you, stalking you. They can't stop thinking about you. This is what I'm saying. It's causing an imbalance in this person's life. I mean, <laughs> this is a Libra reading. Libra, you know, is all about balance. But clearly there's an imbalance here. This person... Without you, oh, yeah, this is what I'm getting. Without you in this person's life, they, this person feel like they, ha they don't have balance. Wow. 
you bring this person balance. I mean, nobody else does it for them. That's why they're dropping their options and situationships they're attached to because it's just bring it's not bringing them the balance that they need. You complete this person here. I mean, they're obsessed with you. They're addicted to you and everything. They feel like you complete them. You are the one. Yeah, because we've got soulmates as well. This is a soulmate connection, you guys. This person feels like you are their soulmate. Soul connection, partnership, agreement, soul contract. This is why we've got the star card. You guys are destined to be. This is what I'm saying. You guys are destined to be. You're destined to be with this person. Yeah. I mean, I feel like they didn't know it until you took yourself out of this equation. And then uh, this is when it's, it's, they're starting to realise, it's starting to hit them that you are the one. You guys have got to make the connection because they cannot stop thinking about you. It's driving this person crazy. It doesn't matter who they're with. Yeah, they can't stop thinking about you. They could be with other people and they still compare these people to you. Whatever, if they're in a relationship, marriage, whatever it is, they're still they're comparing their partner to you. If they if they're not married, if they're single and they're dating, whoever they meet, they're compared to you. This person is driving them crazy. They really feel like you are their soulmate. You know, this person really feels like that you're their soulmate. We got not enough as well, frustrated in relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, fear, slash ego, issues, jealousy. Yeah, because you took yourself out of this equation. Yes, what I'm saying, they miss you, lack of confidence. This person's nervous. Yeah, this person's nervous to reach out to you here. Self-indulgence as well, focus on self, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work. Self-appreciation. Yeah, because you took yourself out of this equation. Because you know your worth. We've got self-worth here. Yeah, you know your worth, you know. You focus on yourself right now. You've done your shadow work. You're healing. You know your worth. And this is why this person feels inadequate now. Because they, they lack the confidence to even suggest this new beginning with you, much less... Because, uh, yeah, you took yourself out of this equation. Now they don't feel good enough for you. Or they lack confidence. You make this person nervous. This is why they're getting help from friends. They feel like they need help and support from others. They need to get some support here to gain some confidence here. They must really love you a lot. I really feel like this is someone that loves you a lot. There's a lot of love here. You make them nervous here. They don't want to mess up with you again. I really feel like this person wants to turn over a new leaf here. Come clean. Yeah, it leads me to this message as well. The sword and rose. Clarity, truth, revelation, solidarity, force, honour, protection, power. Yeah, they want to come clean here. This person wants to come clean. They've gained clarity, that's what I'm saying. I feel like this is someone that's gaining some a reality check right about now because <laughs> they're gaining some clarity during this time. It's like they, they realise that they, you know, lack of balance in their life because you're not in it. I feel like this person wants to win you back. This person wants you back in their life. They want to win you back. There's a lack of balance. No matter who they're with, they still don't feel complete without you. They're getting that reality check now. Yeah. So uh, expect to hear from this person. You know, just a matter of time, you guys. Because they're watching you. They're looking. Watching you. Stalking you even. And they are constantly thinking about you here. Yeah. And they are. I feel like they're, they're thinking about approaching you. Uh, they may be thinking about ways to approach you as well. They're getting help from their friends here. But it's a big deal for this person here. <laughs> it's a big deal. So good luck. 
to be continued you guys so thanks for watching and i'll see you again soon